Hello, my dear viewers. Welcome once again to Mass Medicine with anybody. In today's class, we want to look at algebraic fraction. So, we are asked to express as a single fraction. So, we are given this question, and this question is subtraction of fraction. Now, the first thing we are going to do is to find the LCA. Now, to find the LCM of this, I'm going to take the product of this, this multiplied by this. So in that case, my LCM is going to be x into bracket x minus 2 into bracket x plus 3. So this is going to be my LCM. Now, the next thing is to use this to divide this. So if you use this to divide this, this will cancel out this, then you'll be left with this. So in that case, I will have this in this, I will have this. So I'm going to have x plus 3 multiplied by the numerator. So I'm going to have times x minus this in this. So if this cancel out this, I'll be left with this. I will now use this to multiply this. So I'm going to have x minus 2 and then x plus 2. So I'm going to use this to multiply each other too. Now the next thing is to say x times x. Then this we have x squared. x times plus 3. I'm going to have plus 3x. The minus will still be here. Then here, let me open bracket for this. Because I want to use this to multiply each other. Now x times x, I'm having x squared x times plus 2, I will be having 2x, minus 2 times s, minus 2x, minus 2 times plus 2, I will have it minus 4. All over. Then, here I am having into bracket s, minus 2, into bracket s plus 3. Now, the next thing to do, let's rearrange this, okay? Before I rearrange, I'm going to say x squared plus 3x. Now, let me use this to multiply everything in the brackets. So, I'm going to have, okay, the first thing, you can see that this is plus 2x minus 2x. So, they can, they can cancel out each other. Because plus 2x minus 2x will give you 0. So, let's just cancel out each other. So, in the brackets, I will be having x squared minus 4. For this negative sign outside, we multiply what we have in the bracket. So I'm going to have minus times x squared minus x squared. And then minus times minus 4 I'll be having plus 4. All over into brackets x minus 2 into brackets x plus 3. Now the next thing I can now rearrange. So x squared minus x squared plus 3x plus 4 all over into bracket x minus 2 into bracket x plus 3 then i'm going to have if this cancel out this because x square minus x square is 0 then i'll be having 3x plus 4 all over x minus 2 into bracket x minus 2 and into bracket s plus 3 and this is going to be my final answer so this is the solution to this question. So, we have been able to express this as a single fraction. Thanks for watching, guys.